How are you guys enjoying PRISM Live Studio? In this video, we're going to talk about something that a lot of people have been asking about, how to integrate broadcast platforms and RTMP. There are currently two ways to integrate live platforms into the PRISM application. First, by logging into your account on the live platform. And second, by retrieving real-time messaging protocol information, also known as RTMP, from the live platform and entering it directly into the PRISM application. RTMP information typically consists of two parts, the RTMP URL and the RTMP stream key. The URL of RTMP is mostly the same across platforms, while the stream key is different for each user. In other words, it's a protocol for streaming, like an email address or a phone number. Not too hard to understand, right? In the PRISM application, there is a menu called Custom RTMP that allows you to enter your custom RTMP information. Let's take a look at it together. First, launch the PRISM app Select Live from the bottom tab and press the white Ready button to display the Live Ready screen. Click the circle profile icon in the lower left corner of the application. You'll see the Select Channel tab. Press the Add button in the upper left corner of the layer. When the Connect Account menu appears, at the bottom, you should see a custom RTMP button. The button will take you to the RTMP settings menu. Here, you can enter your RTMP information. In the stream name area, type a name to manage the list. Next, in the stream or URL field, enter the RTMP stream URL you receive from the live platform. And in the stream key field, enter the RTMP stream key. You will see the advanced settings menu. Use this in your live platform requires credentials for RTMP streaming. Click the Save button at the top of the screen to return to the Live Ready screen. You will see that the information you set up was entered correctly. If you have integrated your platform with custom RTMP, don't worry. You can still use the Resolution button to set the streaming quality. We mentioned earlier that there are two ways to integrate platforms in the PRISM app. Login is probably the easier way to go, but many live platforms don't support it at this time. Some streamers will have no choice but to use a custom RTMP. Prism app offers a lot of features for streamers, but unfortunately, there are some features that are not supported if you integrate the platform with a custom RTMP. For example, you won't be able to see title information, see your viewers' chats during the live stream, or see the number of viewers or likes. Unfortunately, we can't provide this information because the application relies on using the Live Platform API, which is only available via login integration. Today, we put together a guide for users who are struggling with the custom RTMP feature. Hope this was helpful and thank you for watching. I'll be back with another guide soon, so stay tuned and until then, happy streaming. See ya. Bye.